everybody. Today is Monday, March 30th. We are in the first day of week two of distance learning. Our distance learning is extended at least through May 5th. So we're going to be here for a while. I'm committed to making a video every single day of school that we have. Hopefully you had a relaxing weekend. Uh, I had a very relaxing weekend myself, not a whole lot going on, the weather wasn't super great. Did get a chance to get outside when the weather was nice and get some good stuff done. So we have a full schedule today here on this Monday morning. First thing I want to point out is our word of the day. I did add some more words to Google Classroom, at least one. So our word today is skeletal system. It supports your body and gives it shape. It also stores calcium and other minerals. It also protects the organs and produces blood cells. Within the hollow of your bones, there's bone marrow, and that's where blood cells are made. Your assignment for today and tomorrow that can be found on Google Classroom is a New Zella article about the immune system. So on that assignment, I put four different versions of the article. Please connect the article with your AR score and the Lexile score. And if you see on the assignment I've shown you, if your AR score is here near here, read this one. And if you want, just choose whichever one seems good. And then if it's a little too advanced, drop down one. Or if it seems like you could do a little bit higher, go up one. You'll, it, they're all there. Then there is an attached Google Doc that has questions and some vocabulary to define. So take a look at that um, on Google Classroom. That's due next Sunday. All my assignments are going to be due on Sunday. Wednesday, I will be putting up a new assignment. Also, be sure to check in to our uh, Zoom meetings that are uh, every day this week at 11. We might change the time, but as of now, it's going to be every day at 11. Optional. Super fun to see you all in there. All right. So hopefully um, you got all your work in from last week. I'm getting caught up on my grading right now, and you'll get to check that out um, on Google Classroom, your grades. All right, so unless there are any other questions about skeletal system, uh-huh, in the back? I can't hear you. Okay. Um, how many bones do you have in your body? That's a great question. I don't know that off the top of my head. Let me go ahead and um, Google that. How many bones in the human body? That's a great question. How many bones? Oh, that's the first hit on uh, Google for that. The human skeleton is the internal framework of the human body. It's composed of around 270 bones at birth. And this total decreases to around 206 bones by adulthood. After some bones get fused together. Wow. So you have more bones at birth. And then less um, as you go on because they fuse together. That's pretty cool. Great question in the back. I love it when you ask good questions like that. It makes class much more interesting when we ask great questions, okay? Let's see if there's any quick skeleton jokes and then we'll get the weather. Skeleton jokes, skeleton puns for Reader's Digest. Reader's Digest is always good. Um, okay. Why did the skeleton climb up the tree? Because a dog was after his bones. Not a joke. I don't get that one. Can someone, because a dog was after his bones? Okay. How, I need to vet these jokes. How did the skeleton know it was going to rain on Halloween? He could feel it in his bones. Yes, we understand that skeletons have bones, but that's not an original. All right, that's done. Ooh, the hardest riddles ever. 25. I'm going to save this for later. Maybe I'll give you one tomorrow. 25 hardest riddles. Okay. All right, let's get back on track. All right, let's go ahead and um, if you, unless you have any other questions about the assignment today, let's go ahead and get our weather journals open. Page five, I need to get up and switch to the dot cam. Ooh. Oh boy. Here we go. Search, search. Boop, 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 boop. Last week, I didn't quite zoom in enough, so I apologize. Uh, I'm going to zoom in a little bit better today so you can really see it nice and well. Although I'm going to say it, and you can also um, just do the weather whatever time you're watching this video. You are. Okay. So, today's date, 
is March 30th. There's 31 days in March. 20. Uh, the time here right now is 10.52. I'm going to wrap this up in a minute and then open up my Google or Zoom meeting. Someday I'll get that right. 58.8. And let's see, anyone guesses 58.8 F2C? Yeah, in the back? Mm hmm. 14.6. That's really close. But no. Oh, yeah. What's up in the front? Mm hmm. 14. Point, you got it. 14.9. Man, that kid is on it today. Someone had their Wheaties this morning. All right, then we got humidity, 63%. Is this on the screen? Good. Our pressure is nice and high. We're gonna have beautiful weather this week, 30.23. Wind speed, 2.2. And I'm looking outside, it's partly cloudy. I have a little issue with the Sunny song. When it's sunny, anytime I use that song in my video, I get a copyright claim. So I'm going to have to find out a workaround for that. All right, so today we did the vocab skeletal system. We talked about the week's assignment. We did the weather. And I think I'm going to wrap up right now. So hopefully I see you in the optional goo, uh, goo, goo? Zoom. Zoom meet later. It's going to be in seven minutes. So I guess if you're watching this, that's already happened. But anyway, we do it every day at 11. So check that out. Let me play my song as we go. Have a great Monday.